If I come up and I fall off, that's on me. That's on me. If I come up. And I official PhD students. Um, so the class went well. It's on Thursdays from 8.30 a.m. to 11.30. Um, it's great early, but I don't mind it. There's four of us in the class. I think there's supposed to be six, but two students are having issues with their um, visa cards. So anyways, after class was done, I decided to um, stop by the Ottawa U Library, as you saw or store and I picked up two things. So I picked up a pack of mechanical pencils. These are just the big velocity ones. I picked these up because the eraser is pretty like wide and thick. And so I use pens most of the time, but because I do want to um, write a little bit more or actually I want to write more and practice my writing way more. I think pencils are gonna be easier just so I can go back and erase because with the um, pens, although it's like cleaner, I hate using white out. So I decided to pick these up and I also picked up a nice U Ottawa notebook so this one cost me i think it was $8.99 and these were $8.99 so in total it came to $21 so do the math um kenzo's right here beside me i just took him out from to a walk i just took him out to a walk ah kenzo so kenzo is very needy right now because like i said i left without telling him and he just ruined my sweater <sighs> bullies i tell you they will bully you um but anyways, as I was saying, I came back home, I took him out for a walk, and now he's playing with his secret treat. He's gonna be super loud. Um, Miguel is also happy and chirping away, as you can hear him in the background. Um, so the pets are good, they're fine. It's just Kenzo is a little needy. He just finished eating lunch as well. I'm about to actually start eating lunch. Um, I meal prepped yesterday some couscous with zucchini, bell pepper, cilantro, and kale. And then I also made myself a nice little um, fried egg. And I just topped it off with some peri-peri sauce and sriracha. So this is what it looks like. That's what I'm going to have for lunch. Um, and I'm going to finish my vitamin water. I bought one too at the store. So, um, well, this morning at, at campus. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to eat, 
then i'm going to do well switch the laundry because as soon as i came back home took out the trash and started some laundry but now i'm going to just enjoy some food uh, catch up on emails if i have any i don't think i do but i'm still gonna check them and then once i finish eating switch the laundry i'm gonna start working on the thesis corrections um and hopefully i can be done that tonight and then tomorrow i can review and i can send it off to my supervisor tomorrow but what i'm thinking is that i'm gonna finish writing it tomorrow or doing the revisions tomorrow and then just kind of leaving the weekend for a breather making sure everything is fine on sunday and then send it maybe on monday but i still don't know it really depends on how i feel today but yesterday i made a lot of progress in the revisions and i feel really good about it so that's it um the seminar i think is going to be really fun i've never had a class with this professor but he seems really nice really understanding um and yeah i mean the the people that are taking the seminar with me i already know them They're, they are my colleagues so there's no one really new except for the two students are struggling with their visas um, but hopefully i get to meet them at one point um other than that that that's it that's i think how my tuesdays or not tuesdays how my thursdays are gonna look um 8 30 to 11 30 be at university after that come back home do my things with kenzo and then just kind of have the afternoon to work um but i think it's pretty manageable and so the next thing i want to do actually or not next thing but one of the things i want to do tonight or today is um send an email to the department to see if i can audit a 101 philosophy class because i just want to have a stronger foundation in philosophy i'm very weak in that area and there is you know in in anthropology we use philosophy to theorize um so and conceptualize theorize and conceptualize so for me I never took any of those courses because um, I just never had the opportunity to take the 101 courses at university because I had attended college before. So I just kind of had to do the credits to get the diploma, um, which was good because it avoided me going through all of those 101, 101 courses, but at the same time, now as a master's and phd student or a graduate student i realized the um, necessity importance of those courses so i'm gonna see what i can do about that uh, because this semester i'm only taking one phd seminar plus doing my other responsibilities but i think i can definitely handle a one-on-one philosophy course on top of all of that so we're going to see um but that's it that's it for today uh just eat thesis work and then probably make dinner later on tonight uh there's supposed to be a really big snowstorm overnight tonight we're expecting about 20 centimeters of snow so i know that tomorrow is going to be a stay at home day and probably part of the weekend so i'm just gonna take it easy like i said work on the thesis revisions and then i also want to uh, start doing some of the coursework that i have to do and for the TA ship I have as well. So that's it.